Well, good morning. No, it's probably really early for some of you. If you are over in California, you're probably not even awake yet. Um, but for those over here in the Eastern Standard Time um, zone, or perhaps you're watching the replay, I want to give you guys a really simple strategy when we're looking to detoxify the body. Now, as we know, we need different modalities to cover all different territories within the body, but celery juice is a great way to start. And I oftentimes get people telling, um, asking me, what's your recipe? How do I do it? And there is no recipe. It's very simple. Now, when you get celery, make sure it's organic. Um, it is part of the dirty dozen list, so the toxin load is high, so it does not make sense to be putting toxins in your body to get them out, right? Um, when you use your celery, try to find those without a lot of greens, or if you find ones with a lot of greens, like this is okay, especially since it's a lighter uh, color, more yellow, um, rather than like a deep, deep green. Um, this is another stalk of celery I have now. You can see the color difference, right? So um, with this, the greens would be possibly a little bit darker, but the reason I'm saying that is because the greens of the celery are very bitter. And so oftentimes people will say, I'm not gonna eat that, it's bitter, it's gross. Try to take the greens out and see how you do. And also just maybe add a little bit of water to it. You know, start small. Now, um, when you're making celery, you have two options, celery juice, and that is blend it or food process it. So I've got my food processor here, but if you have a high powered blender, like a Vitamix or a Blendtec, and then a nut bag. Now this dame is old, that is my juicer. So I use a nut bag um, just because sometimes I do get pulp in here, but that way it'll be nice and you know, pure of pulp um, because we want to be easy on the digestive system. So when you are cutting celery, make sure you look out for dirty spots I'm just going to rinse this off real quick um, because dirt is gritty. Nobody wants to eat dirt, right? Um, so I'm going to honestly just food process this, um, or not food process this, sorry, juice this. So put it in my juicer and slow but steady uh, wins the race. Now, if you have a blender, cut this up, put it in the blender, use the stick for the blender. Don't use a fork or a plunger that does not belong in there because it could mess with the blades. But chop it up. You might need to add a little bit of water. Uh, it just makes it easier. I mean, if you stick this in water at night, <clears throat> first of all, you'll get room temperature celery juice, which I know sounds gross, much easier in the digestive system. We don't want to shock our bodies when we wake up. And it makes it more juicy because it's absorbing the water. If you just cut the bottom off and stick it in water, it's absorbing the water. Now, when you cut it off, just make sure you don't cut it so that, you know, all these pieces are falling off. You want it so that it's in place, all in place. So simple strategy, uh, drink it in the morning and you will pee a lot because it's detoxifying. Uh, you may poop a lot because it's detoxifying. It helps your liver, it helps your digestive system. Um, it helps with a variety of different things. And so if you guys are looking for tips on gut and detox, then come join my masterclass. It's August 23rd. So it's in less than a week. It's next Monday. It's at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and it's completely free to you. I've got some special things leading up after that. So make sure you jump in, stay tuned. And if you would like to join and you've not already, please let me know so I can give you the sign up so that you can get in. All right, guys, well, I'm going to celery juice. I'm going to drink my juice and be on my way for the day. So hope you guys are doing well.